concept art. Now, concept art is a very quick way to convey an idea. So what I'm going to do is try to teach you my concept art workflow. Now we're going to get students that can draw and can't draw. Okay, For those students that can't draw, please feel at ease. I'm not going to make something like this. We're going to take it to a level that everybody can do at once. Okay, You just got to relax and have fun with it. First off, we're going to make this, okay, a sketch pad. So what I need you to do is write down these numbers. That by that. Okay. And then go file new and type those numbers in here and here. Make sure it's 72 res and make sure it's 32 bit. All right. Whoops. Okay. Now Remember in 32-bit world, the fill command does not work. So what we do is make a new layer over the top of this document. And we go like this. Black, edit, fill. Foreground color. And the reason I do this is because of the relaxation of the eye. Okay? The relaxation. So here too bright right I need sunglasses and as I pull this back my eyes will contract right there yours is gonna be a little bit different everybody contracts at a different level so please move this over until you feel your eyes relax good all right, now I'm going to name this video Sketchpad. Okay, so this is setting up your Sketchpad. And usually what I do is I keep a Sketchpad on hand already made up. So I never have to remake this document over and over again. Uh, what's nice about this document is if I went like this, File Print, this came off of a 32 bit document. You can see that this is huge, right? But when I hit scale with it media, it perfectly fits an 8.5 by 11. That's the magic of that document size. And I think I'll share with you how I did that too in this video. So check this out. US paper. Just follow along. You don't have to actually do this. Oop. Yeah, 8.5 by 11 by 72. Then I went like this, image, image size. And I said, well, I want to keep this ratio. So if I went like this, 72, you'll see that 72 and 55, if I all already went back to, let's say 11, it automatically goes back. So being said, if I make this document, And I put a dot in each corner. And on the side here. If I go file print, hit skill to fit media, everything fits. So that's my principle of drawing big, shrinking small. Okay, I wanted to share that with you. So have your sketch pad ready for the next video.